everyone, welcome again to the channel. The latest Isuzu D-MAX pickup truck has received a significant update in Thailand, featuring a fresh appearance and improved interior. This updated version will be available in Australian showrooms either later this year or early next year. The Isuzu D-MAX, which ranks as Australia's third best-selling pickup after the Toyota Hilux and Ford Ranger, is receiving its first major upgrade since it was introduced locally in 2020. Isuzu has released official photos of the updated D-MAX from Thailand, where the vehicle is manufactured. These images showcase a striking new front-end design, redesigned wheels, new taillights and an overhauled interior. The interior enhancements include volume and tuning dials for the infotainment system, new seat patterns and new trim highlights. The Australian release of the updated Isuzu D-MAX is expected to align with previous model upgrades which typically arrive a few months after their debut in Thailand. As a result, customers who have currently placed orders for the existing model in Australian showrooms may end up receiving the new version due to the lengthy waiting times ranging from 6 to 12 months depending on the specific model variant. Recent information from Thailand suggests that the 2024 Isuzu D-MAX and its Mazda BT-50 Twin will not receive any power upgrades under the hood. The engine options will remain the same, with a choice between a 1.9-litre and 3.0-litre turbo diesel four-cylinder. However, there have been numerous exterior and interior changes. The front fascia has been restyled with a more aggressive grille, with top-of-the-range models featuring a black finish. The headlights have also been reshaped, and the tail light signatures now have three extruded elements instead of two found on the current model. The range now offers new wheel designs, including a matte paint finish for the flagship rims equipped on the V-Cross model, sold as the X-Terrain in Australia, as well as updated wheel arch flares. Inside the cabin, top-of-the-range models retain the 9.0-inch infotainment touchscreen, while cheaper models have a 7.0-inch display. However, there have been notable changes to the controls. The fiddly volume and radio tuning buttons have been replaced with two dials, allowing for easier access while driving without diverting attention from the road. Additionally, the cabin now features USB-C ports instead of USB-A sockets and a new brown and black seat upholstery colour scheme is available in Thai models. It appears that the rear cross traffic alert system, which detects obstacles when reversing out of driveways or parking spaces, now has the capability to apply the brakes if it senses an imminent collision. While there is no indication of a hybrid variant, Isuzu has confirmed plans to launch an electric D-MAX in 2025. Norway will be the initial market for this electric version with subsequent expansion to Thailand. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. Feel free to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. See you next time.